Hello? Oh, you want to know how to make a wall, eh? A wall like this? One side will be normal. The other side, you will need black paint, brown paint, white paint, match patch, paintbrush, paintbrush, corrugated cardboard, normal cardboard. You make this the size that you want your fence to be. Craft moss, other craft moss. Plant stuff, wooden shapes for the bottom. Square wooden dowel, scissors, danger, glue gun. Cut your cardboard to size of dowel or get more dowels. Two uh, pieces of the corrugated to match with gosh, two sides glued together. It should look like this. Cut some uh, claw marks very carefully with a knife, like so. And you can paint some rust and stuff in after. Take these shapes, put a dab of glue, and you're going to use them for supports on the bottom. So you put in like that. Now that our fence is gray, we're going to add some uh, brown and then some orange to make it look rusty on one side or both sides if you want an old rusty fence or on no sides if you uh, want a brand new fence. Once you got some uh, brown in here, you want to want to take a little bit of orange, just not as much as the brown, just put a bit like that. Not even that much. Once it is dry, then you can start applying your craft moss. Be very careful applying craft moss with a glue gun. <laughs> Do you know why? Because glue guns are very hot and they will burn your skin. Ow! It really hurts. So you need to, uh, if you don't know how to use a glue gun, especially if you're a kid or something, you need to get your parents to burn their fingers and uh, not you to burn your fingers, right? Put some little bit of glue, not like mechanically. You want to be a little bit random with it because uh, remember folks, nature's not a box unless it is a box. Now I'm going to add a uh, other random little plant things and uh, a bit of vine. Now you can find a tutorial for these vines if you scroll through my page. Like and subscribe and skip rope at vines. We've got our uh, plants and vines. Got some signs here. Danger, Moses, source. And now we just got to coat our fence with Mod Podge.